Hi Sagittarius, welcome to my channel. This reading for today, Sagittarius, this is a collective tarot reading session for you, Sagittarius. I hope you are doing well. I hope you are fine and safe and doing good. This reading for today, this is for the Sagittarius sign. Thank you so much, Sagittarius, for coming back. Thank you so much for being here. If you would like to further connect with me, Sagittarius, you know what to do. All of the details is down in the description box below. Let us see what's coming towards you. What is the guided message for the Sagittarius sign? This reading for today is for the October to November month energy. So I'm channeling the month of October to November. We will pick up love, career, money, and general situationship, okay? This is for the Sagittarius sign. Thank you guys for your support. Thank you guys for being here. Please don't forget to click the bell and click subscribe. And also follow me. I've got another channel exclusively built for the Sagittarius sign. Please also follow me there, okay? So, ooh, look at that three of wands. We will pick up love, career, money, and general situationship. Oh, you have the devil card. You could be dealing with a Capricorn, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Oh, five of pentacles in here. You have the five of swords. The ten of cups. A promise of love. Oh, look at that. Sagittarius. Yeah, queen of pentacles. The three of swords. You have the five of wands. Now let's get, um, let's pull one card for you, Sagittarius. For your overall energy, what's crowning the reading? You've got a king of wands. This is definitely, it's like a relationship reading. You're going to be dealing with the king of wands. The month of October, you will be dealing with a very persuasive person. Persuasion, the king of wands. Let's see. So soon. You could be dealing with this person right now, but I feel like it's a very predictive reading. It means that they're about to contact you, okay? Um, this king of wands, it's crowning your reading. It's the overall energy. When you talk about the king of wands, this is a very playful and powerful connection, okay? It could be someone at work, someone connected to business, or it could be someone of a romantic interest. But I would tell you that this king of wands, they are your perfect match. Because remember, Sagittarius, you are a fire sign. So whoever this person is, it is your match. If this is like a business partner, if this is a person who you're, if this is a person who you are building a bit business building a relationship and you're somehow negotiating with this person they can play your game they can even outsmart you sagittarius you have a match this king of wands um i feel like this king of wands you know them already you know them already you find them like a dark horse you cannot read when they're about to connect or what they're about to do or what they're about to say. They always surprise you, Sagittarius, whoever this person is, okay? Um, but the thing about this person or this connection, Sagittarius, is that they're very playful. They're very, it's, it's so nice. You know, this is an offer or a person that it is so nice to have them around, Sagittarius. It's so nice to have them around it's quite intense there's a bit of challenge with this person they could be stubborn but the thing is it is still so nice to have them around very intense very exciting very very playful if you will have other people between other people and this person you would choose this person definitely if there's a group of people here fun you would still choose this person because they're equivalent 
to at least three to four, six combination of that's how powerful they are in terms of connection, excitement, wit, charm, or in terms of their value. They're very powerful to be with, okay? So you're going to be dealing with them um, very soon. A portion of October month to November month, this King of Wands will put you in a good, exciting spirit, Sagittarius. It could be a lover, okay? Or it could be a person who somehow they're impressing you. I take your hand. I mean, look at that. The devil card. This is them. Take my hand. Trust me. I will bring you to the future. Three of Wands. Six of Pentacles. Let's look at the Six of Pentacles. What this person brings you or offer. Five of Wands. You do have some competitive factor with this person. If this is a business, it's your competition. But then they want to do business with you. If this is romance, romantic, you've got some witty bantering. This is playing Cupid, playing hard to get. But the thing is, you always submit to them and they always submit to you. It's a perfect balance. Five and six. Which means that there are some days that you chase them. There are some days that they chase you. So there's a, it's a very good balance of power. There's a very good balance of power with this person, Sagittarius. The three of wands, I feel like this person or offer, or connection, whether they're a businessman, a lover, maybe friend, no. It's either, it could be a romance or a business partnership, okay? Um, it's, a, it's, it's a business partnership or a partnership that would like to grow, not from 50% or 60%. This person, or offer, or situation, it is wanting to grow, above and beyond it's willing to put extra layers of fertilizer to make your connection grow it's it's wanting a shortcut so if this is a business partnership they want you to sign if normally the contract is you know seven days to review this person will bypass that or offer they want you to sign up as soon as possible so the month of october you will come across a very persuasive. They've got a silver tongue, Sagittarius. They can convince you. The devil card. Look at that. You know, they've got a charm of a king of wands and a width of a king of swords. You finally meet your match, Sagittarius. And they've got some move like a devil card. Look at that. I don't think you cannot, you can resist this person. Look at that. They're not only charming, they're also physically very bankable, whoever this person is, I would say. Emotionally, mentally, physically bankable. Look at that, the devil card. It's wanting to have a business with you. You are doing a business with the devil. It's like Lucifer, okay? There's something mysterious, charming, and enigmatic about this person or situation, okay? Now, five of pentacles. Look at that, five, five, five. Let's look at the five of pentacles. You're scared. You know what? This could be love, Sagittarius. I feel like you're scared to deal with this person because it looks like you're going to fall in love with them. For the very first time, you met someone irresistible. If this is not love, this is business. But for the very first time, you met someone like you. Someone who is irresistible. Someone who can play with your alpha, masculine and feminine, Sagittarius. I wouldn't say it's a soulmate. It's beyond that. They could morph. This is a very exciting situation, Sagittarius. Because Five of Swords. I don't know. It's the first time I'm tapping into this energy. Because you couldn't say it's a Two of Cups. You couldn't say it's a soulmate. Because it's beyond that. It's a person that 
is made for you in such a way that they will morph. If you needed them to be your friend, they will be a friend. If you needed them to be your lover, they will be your lover. If you need them to, I don't know, be romantic as as much as you want them to be, they could be that. If you want them to be your challenge, they could be that. So they're they're look they're a powerful energy shape shifter, whoever this person is. They shift based on you what you need. They were made for you. It is scary because it's your match, Sagittarius. Not only that, for the very first time, you are so happy that someone can really connect with you in a very magical but dark kind of vibe, Sagittarius. This person is going to seduce you, Sagittarius. It feels like a lover, Sagittarius. It's very exciting. Page of Pentacles, they're going to make a move. You know this person. You find them very mysterious. And then when they start talking, connecting, you will be, you will not be disappointed. You will feel the Ten of Cups straight on the spot. You will meet, you will feel this Ten of Cups with them, Sagittarius. And look at that, the king and the queen. I told you, this is your match. It is morphing. Um, So they will invite you. This person will not waste their time. It means they will be very straightforward and charming and playful to what exactly they want from you. Um... They're the king of wands and you're the queen of wands. It means they're ahead of the game. So whatever they ask you, you will reply. And they're more advanced than you. I wouldn't say they're winning over you, but they simply can read you, Sagittarius. They know your game or they know exactly what you think, what you feel. They're very intuitive. And you might feel like you're winning, but they're actually wanting you to win, okay? It is a person who is going to get what they want from you in such a way that you will feel like the winner, but they're actually the winner. I know, Sagittarius, it would be sunshine. Who is this person? I have no idea, but... It's a king of wands and it's an October to probably the first week of November. I believe you know them. I believe you have an idea who this person is, but you never expect that this is how intense they are. Three of Cups. They will date you or they will spend a lot of time with you because they want to bring out the queen of wands. They know that there is a lot to catch up, to know, to explore with you, Sagittarius. So they're going to lavish you with the Three of Cups. Drinks, dinner, spend time with you, a lot of talks, a lot of dark, but fun. It's a, it's a I would say, you know, who, whoever this person is quite deadly. It's quite, it's quite enigmatic because their humor is dark and their wit is unparalleled. That's why you, they even compliment you. They know how to compliment you. They know how to please you in some way. So this is you. You feel like a queen or a king whenever they're around. They know exactly what to say. If they piss you off or if they're about to disappoint you or if at some point in your connection, you know, the getting to know maybe or the exchange of message, they they could give you this. They know exactly how to counter it. It's a very mysterious offer, but it's a very exciting offer. Five of Wands. This is beyond your comprehension. It's exciting and it's also dark because it could go more than 100 or it could go rock bottom. 
there's only two things, two outcome in here. It could be negative or it could be really like a trailblazer. You know, it could be negative or it could be a jack, extreme. The thing is, I don't think there's a room for error or lost because you're a perfect match. So you will deliver, they will deliver, you will bring the best and the darkness to each other. And those, like you will bring the best and probably the worst. The thing is, even though you set them the worst and they give you the worst, you can still take each other because you're the queen and the king. In fact, you guys are both attracted in dark humor or there's something there's something mysterious and underground this person but at the end it is the passion really very unique you will discover yourself in such a way that you never think thought or you never see the side of you only this person can trigger that and it and i believe it's a good thing like there's some darkness in here, but it's a good one. It's bittersweet. Yeah, three of pentacles. They're going to start to plant the seed. So expect the first seven to ten days of October, this person will show up. Very charming, very funny. But if you look at them, there's more to it. Look at that. Look at that face enigmatic yeah you know this person is going to give you an impression that i'm not interested with you but you know in your heart in that fire the fire that lives in your heart knows that this is just the surface level yeah because this is what they gave you the death card you can't read them but deep inside Look at that. This is how much they want you from the inside. They will never allow you to read them. So it's so hard to read this person. You would have to really rely to your very high, higher self, high instinct to be able to read this person. Yeah. They have an offer. Don't worry. Um, As soon as they're comfortable with you, as soon as... They feel that they can be themselves, comfortable to you. You will get, as soon as you get them, uh, they won't waste time. They will offer you the Ace of Pentacles. This is the actual offer. You've got a lot of things to explore with them. You will be the happiest and also somehow somehow this person if you choose them you might isolate yourself to others so if this is a brand new relationship you might spend a lot of time possessively with each other like you guys are addicted with each other that you might not be needing other people it's just them for the next couple of at least the end of december like there's so much contentment just being with them or it could be like 20% it could be a business partnership. No. 10% it could be business. But 90% it is a very intense, dark night of your soul lover kind of thing. Um, so the Nine of Cups. This will be a successful relationship. You would notice that you're going to be very possessive with each other. Like intensely into each other like in to each other that you will find yourself probably most of the most of the time you're together those other friends that you are connected or close you might i'm really picking up you might isolate yourself to others and intensely just hanging out with them there's so much contentment to just being with them for a good nine weeks after that nine months you're pregnant <laughs> just kidding but after that you'll start to you know break up from the possessive it's like honeymoon stage you know 
So this is very, very intense, Sagittarius. I tell you, it's very, very intense. But it's very, very you. <laughs> you love it, Sagittarius. You've never feel, felt this perp. Like, you've never felt so alive with this devil card. I mean, look at that. So this is your reading, Sagittarius. Thank you so much for connecting with me. Thank you so much for being here. If you would like to further connect with me, please click the bell. Click subscribe. And I'll see you soon again, guys. You have a daring devil. Enjoy, Sagittarius. Bye-bye.